you all welcome back to my channel and if you are new to my channel hey girl hey so i'm just coming to you guys to show you how i install um my liquid cap quick weaves um the color tutorial for this hair is already up on my channel i will leave it right there in the eye and i'll also leave it in the description box so y'all i'm not gonna ramble talk too much let's get right into the video all right, y'all, so I'm starting out with freshly washed and blow-dried hair. I have my leave off sectioned out, and I'm using the 30-second molding gel to put my hair into a ponytail. So now that my hair is in this little ponytail, I'm going to apply some more gel onto the ponytail. I'm just gonna take my ponytail and flatten it up like that. Flatten it upwards. And then put gel on it to make it stick. So now you can either take a blow dryer and blow this dry, or you can sit up under the hooded dryer like I'm about to do. So I'm gonna sit up under my hooded dryer and then I'll be right back. All right, so now that my hair is completely dry, I'm gonna go ahead and apply the Salon Pro 30 Second Moroccan Argan Oil Weave Wonder Wrap. Um, I'm gonna just read what it says on here. Moisturizes your hair and scalp. Protective barrier between hair and glue. Argan oil to repair and revitalize your hair. Um, helps prevent hair loss, prevents itchy scalp. Easy to apply and remove, loaded with botanicals. Yeah, so I'm using a tinting brush to apply the Weave Wonder Wrap to my head. You want to make sure that you get the Weave Wonder Wrap everywhere that you are going to be placing your tracks everywhere. Um, all you have to do to remove this is apply water, you guys, and the tracks literally will slide right off of your hand. That is why I love doing quick weaves using this Weave Wonder Wrap. Like, it's bomb. Okay y'all, so I'm going to go ahead and finish applying this to my head. So after you apply the um, Wonder Wrap to your head, you need to make sure that it is completely dry. When it's dry, you will know because your hair will turn shiny. Like it will be really, really shiny. And I'll show y'all what I'm talking about right here. Okay, so if y'all can see, it's super, super shiny. This is what I was talking about. So yeah, that's how you know it's done when it's super duper shiny. With your security, you can go ahead and slip on a cap. And I feel like some, like my actual ponytail part, might not be completely dry, so I'm gonna just use the cap. Now I'm not gonna start at the very nape of my neck, just because the area of my hair is sensitive, so I'm gonna start a little bit above that. Okay y'all, so now I'm gonna just start applying the tracks to my head, and I just sped through this, cause y'all already know how to glue tracks, you know? So I didn't feel the need to show me putting the glue on tracks and all that. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna just let y'all watch this and I'll be back. Okay, so now I'm gonna just go ahead and carefully cut off the excess cap um, in the middle where my leave out is and all around the perimeter of my head. Okay, so now I'm gonna just take my hot comb and run over my roots and my edges because it was looking real rough, I already know, so don't come for me. <laughs> but don't worry, I'm gonna land slam real quick. So now I'm gonna go ahead and blend my leave out with the hair. So I'm gonna take my flat iron and go over my actual hair. And then what I like to do is take a track and glue it in my leave out to help it blend better. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and curl my hair with my flat iron. And how I like to curl my hair is by alternating directions. So what I mean by that is 
if I curl one piece backwards, the next piece that I do will be forward. So I just alternate going forwards and backwards, like towards my face, then um, away from my face. And just keep alternating like that. If y'all want me to do a more in-depth curling video, then let me know. That's pretty much all I did. I put a little bit of oil on my Lee routes and sprayed some hairspray on my curls. And you already know I had to lay my edges down with my favorite Culture Company edge tamer, my handy dandy toothbrush. This is the finished look, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank y'all so much for watching, and I'll catch y'all in my next video.